Welcome to Data Doctor's video, Suggestion 511, Unique Name, Spelling. Suggestion 511 is caused when, based on statistics, a first name is unique in the database. It is either misspelled, or the spelling is correct, and the suggestion should be marked false. Here is the suggestion report for Alberta May McNatt, showing only one suggestion for the first name spelled A-A-L-B-E-R-T-A. When you click on her first name in the name column, you are shown an analysis for all Albertas on Wikitree. There is only one. Here is the public view of Alberta's profile. A book is the only source given, with no excerpts specifically about Alberta. Click on the Root Search link on the middle right of the page. Root Search offers several sites to choose from. Let's start with Family Search. Note, you have to be logged into that site first. There are no records for Alberta McNatt with two A's at the front of her name. Let's try a variation of the first name and spell it with one A at the front. We are shown three records for this spelling. Find a grave, a 1920 census, and a 1910 census, both census records listing her with the correct parents. On the far right of the 1910 census, click on the icon. The next screen shows the census record, confirming the spelling of her first name. Keep this screen open. Following the Family Search link to her Find a Grave Memorial, we can see a photo of her headstone, confirming again how her name is correctly spelled. Return to her profile and click Edit. In the Data section, correct her first name in both the proper and preferred name fields. In the Biography section, correct her name. Then add the information for both census records. Place your cursor behind the 1910 census and click the citation button above. Return to the Family Search 1910 census and click on Document Information. Copy the text that appears. On Alberta's profile, paste that citation between the ref tags. Repeat the process for the 1920 census. Create a subheading, Research Notes. Explain that her name is spelled A-L-V-E-R-T-A according to census records and to her headstone photo. Place your cursor behind the headstone photo text and set up the citation reference tags as before. From the Family Search source, Go to Find a Grave and copy the source citation, pasting it onto Alberta's profile in Research Notes, making sure to add the Wikitree template and to delete the first URL in the citation. Click on Preview to check your work. Make sure that the inline citations are properly showing in the Biography and Sources sections. Go to the middle of the profile page and explain your changes. This is strongly recommended for all Wikitree users and is required for data doctors. For me, I identify myself as a data doctor, copy the suggested number and name, and explain what I changed. Save your work. Return to the suggestions report and on the far right click on status. On the Suggestion Status page, make sure your Wikitree ID is showing. Of the five status options, choose one. In this case, correct it. Leave a comment from the commentants or make one of your own. I chose a comment and added to it. Click the Update Status button. The last screen shows the status history has recorded your changes and you're done.
you are invited to like this video and even leave a comment if you wish. Also, keep up to date with new videos by subscribing to our Wikitree YouTube channel. On behalf of the Data Doctors Project, thank you for watching.